You know, I, I'm a big fan of the artifact. I like to see, uh, you know, the guitar of so and so. You know, for me, walking into the Rock Hall of Fame down in the basement and seeing John Cipollina's amplifier, uh, you know, one of the great moments in my going to museums. Um, you know, there's something about a museum that means that something is kind of cut into stone and it's, it's not alive. But I think what's really important about the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame is that it is alive. You know, that these instruments and these players are still around or they're venerated or they're saluted. And you get a sense of, of, of who they are. You know, I look at Buddy Holly's magnetone amplifier and think this is the same amplifier that when I was a kid I bought off my next door, not the exact same, but the same, you know, and, and I feel a relation to the history of rock and roll. I think it's, it's important to have a place to gather and pay homage. And for me, that's what the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame is about. And I like the fact that it's not just a Hall of Fame, it's not just kind of busts of whoever is famous at that moment in time. Uh, the collections, of which they're rather vast at this point, are very kind of uh, down home. Uh, everybody's in it. Uh, there's a postcard that I sent from Europe to Patti Smith's mother in there, and uh, it's, it's, it makes it human. I mean, I think when you look at all the artifacts and the history and the way it's presented, you come out of there with appreciation of the scope of the music and its importance over, you know, the more than half century that it's been in music and where it comes from and hopefully where it's going because, uh, you know, this is a living, breathing art form. It's not, it's not something that's kind of uh, an antique, you know, rock and roll. <clears throat> You can, you know, there's something so elemental about the music, so simple that it keeps coming around, keeps coming around because it's, it's kind of a, you know, a proving ground for the human self and uh, I'm happy to, you know, be a part of it.